Minneapolis, a couple things to remember, no smoking or alcohol. They're both banned by federal regulations. Our first stop is going to be Cameron, then we'll hit Bethany. We're going to take a break in Bethany. After Bethany, it is Lamoni, Osceola, Des Moines, Ames, Williams, Dudley's Corner, Mason City, Albert Lee. We'll take another break in Albert Lee. After Albert Lee, it is Owatonna, Fairville, Birdsville, Minneapolis. With all that being said, if I have extra time in my schedule, I will let you know and I will let you out of the bus and stretch your legs and your lungs, whichever you prefer. But unless I let you know we have the time, please remain on the bus. That's the easiest way to get left somewhere. I get busy helping other passengers. I don't see you get out of the bus to use the rest of running water. I jump back in the driver's seat and take off. You got a 24-hour potty break. Please be considerate with your electronic devices. Use with the volume down low or use your earbuds. Please don't hold loud conversations over your cell phone. Just be courteous to your neighbors. Please don't throw anything down the toilet. There's a garbage bag right behind me and one back by the restroom. Eventually one of my partners back at the shop's got to climb down there and clean the big stuff out of there. And that's just not my idea of a lot of fun. If you need to use the restroom, the door pushes to open. Lock the door behind you. There's a little latch right underneath the handle. That'll turn the inside light on. It'll turn the indicator light on the outside on to let people know it's occupied. And it'll give you a little privacy. Gentlemen, if you're using the facility while the bus is in motion, please have a sit down. It doesn't matter how smooth I drive or how good your aim is, you're going to make a mess back there. And I'm pretty sure the ladies on board would appreciate you not doing that. And that's pretty much all I got. Sit back, enjoy your ride. I'll get you to your destination as safely as I can.